What is up guys? Uh, Clemenade here. Um, I'm down here in Arkansas and I was kind of cleaning, cleaning out my closet, if you will, today. Um, kind of gathering all the Frisbees that I have laying around. So my bag in the garage, in the spare bedroom, in the car, in the backyard, just all the discs that I have in kind of, kind of going over everything that I have. I'm not really a hoarder. I don't have a whole lot of like rare gems. Um, yeah, I don't really collect discs. I have a lot of like stuff that I throw, um, but I do have some pretty cool stuff and I wanted to kind of show you guys what I got. All right, well, I guess, I guess the easiest part, uh, or the easiest thing to start with would be my bag. Um, yeah, here's my bag. I'm actually working on it in the bag and I'm gonna be releasing that soon, kind of a, a quarantine in the bag. But yeah, you know, judges up top. Um, got the got the roller and the max distance defender. That's really flippy. Yeah, and then, you know, uh, harps, mids, uh, fairway, explore, get away, all the way up to warhorse and uh, enforcer and defender. Um, so pretty simple. Um, a lot of the stuff that I have is nothing like crazy special, nothing like Scott Reek or, you know, I've seen Emac, uh, Emac's collection and it's pretty insane. But, uh, yeah, I guess we'll, uh, this, this thing's pretty cool. It's, uh, it's a Biofusion Maverick. I got this a couple years ago. Got a team stamp. It's pretty, pretty sick. Uh, so... These are super cool. Uh, these are first run classic judges. Um, super duper nice. I actually have a black one as well. Uh, and this thing, these are awesome. These, I actually got these this winter um, from one of my buddies named Riley in Kansas City. And he kind of messaged me and was like, hey man, you wanna, you wanna, you want some judges? I was like, yes, I do. So thanks for those, man. And uh, these will probably be my putting putters over the next couple of years, to be honest. Um, all right. So yeah, we got a got a sweet sweet bounty recoil prototype. Uh, got to have the Warhorse team prototype. That one's nice. This one's really really overstable. Uh, Brian Shintaku hooked me up with though with those um, prototype Raider. This thing is. This thing's juicy, man. I've just kind of been holding on to it. Uh, haven't, I've had a couple people ask about it, but yeah. All right, so I guess we'll first, hey, look at this, Missy Cannon Harp. I actually threw that at Ledgestone last year, I think. Uh, I like lost one of my good harps right before the tournament. And so I needed a harp and she hooked me up. I actually, in this box, this is kind of just some random stuff uh, that I have just kind of stamps that I've had over the last couple of years. Some like new discs, throwers, nothing like too, too, too crazy. It's cool judges. Um, got, uh, got one of these left. This Jordan Castor actually gave me this a month ago. He still had it. I didn't have any of those stamps left. So that was cool of him. All right. Now, now we're gonna get to some to some cool stuff. All right, so I guess we'll kind of just go down the line here. This is my box of like cool things that I figured people would enjoy seeing. These are felons, uh, a very early run, maybe even first run felons. Um, these are the ones like if you guys remember Ricky. Wasaki, he was throwing these a couple a couple years ago when he was on Latitude. Uh, I know AJ threw one just like this, and I have my used one. I think I think that's it, right there. Um, but yeah, these are brand new, fresh, ready to go whenever I need them. Um, these I actually these are actually war horses, um, and I picked these up at uh, the Disc Golf Center in uh, in Georgia when we were there for Steady Ed um last last year because they were just they were sweet yeah here's a here's another bounty 
It actually probably belongs with this other one. Um, yeah, I got a, a page shoe, Lucid X Sheriff. It's pretty pretty sick, the new one this year. Um, here's one of my my greenies, we call them. But this one's kind of it's kind of sweet. I threw this a lot at the end of last year, and it started to get a little a little straighter than I wanted. But honestly, it might come back in the bag. Um, it's a really good disc. It's awesome. Uh, this I love this. This is a uh, a Fusion Justice, and it's got the team stamp. I found a stack of these at the I think last year, two years ago, and I love the Fusion Justice. I have mine up here um, that I got from Dixon Jowers, I think. And I just like the Fusion plastic for some reason. It just feels good. I just like it better than I do the Lucid Justice. Yeah, here's another Fusion Hand Eye Justice. It's pretty sick. Uh, I got a pair of Sargents, prototype Sargents. These are pretty, pretty sick. Uh, else I got ooh this this is probably one of the most pretty felons I've ever seen to be honest it is gorgeous it is really old how you can kind of tell is with the uh there's like this nipple right here we call it and it kind of sticks up off the top and uh oh my god this thing just feels amazing it looks amazing it's awesome put that back there um I think I have two of these old Jesper, Jesper Lundmark fuses. It's a pinky. That thing is sick. Who do you guys think I got it from? Jordan Castro, duh. Um, and then another one. This one's brand new. This one's ready to rumble whenever I need it, whenever my yellow one gets too flippy. Um, Lucidex Verdict. Super nice. Kind of similar to one of the ones I throw in my bag. I mean, actually, it's the Twinkie. Um, super stable, super awesome disc. Ooh, check out these VIPX harps. Super sick. That one's awesome. This one's super cool as well. I don't know how many different stamps they even did for these, but yeah, it's super similar to the uh, the one that I throw in my bag now. The one I throw in my bag is kind of. Somebody dyed it, I think. But yeah, it's super cool, super awesome. And here's the the fuse that I throw. You can tell it's it's getting old, getting a little beat up, but I mean, that's what a fuse is for, right? All right, what else we got in here? Ah, Jimmy John's. This is for, was Jordan Castro's go-to enforcer for a couple years. Um, and he gave it to me because he switched to MVP and he and he told me uh he told me it was super beefy. And so I've I've been throwing it over the last month or so, and it is not beefy. He was full of it. Um I think it's just it's just gotten old and beaten up, you know. Uh for me, I feel like when a disc kind of gets gets roughed up right there, uh that'll make it more flippy than getting roughed up on the on the edge. Um, but yeah, this one is super good. It flies super far. It's it's a good disc. Yeah, I got an old prototype Explorer. Pretty pretty cool. Um, Lucid Getaway, super domey. Got it team stamped. Super sick. Um, I got some some old truths. These are the Am Am Worlds. Uh, this one I actually think might be a verdict. Yeah. This one's a verdict, the hybrid, super cool. Uh, another Am World's Truth, yeah, I mean, I love that like milky white plastic. That's how I came the first plastic I kind of felt in love with. Uh, Lucid X Fallon, another Lucid X Fallon, the newest Lucid X Fallon. Gotta support my man, Eric. Um, these are Lucid X Truths that are actually gonna be backups for me this year, you know. Um, a super good disc i'm jamming on it this right here is a lucid x verdict dude this thing is sick it's one of the coolest discs i own emac you can see his name right there he hooked me up with this in the winter and it is oh it's so good it's a super cool disc i kind of want to put it in my bag uh yeah some lucid x mavericks from this year super sick and then we got a greenie right here 
You guys hear me and Castro talking about the greenies all the time. Uh, they're better than the mangoes. Everybody knows that. Um, yeah, and then I just got like some random uh, stacks of judges. Uh, those are harps. And these are a stack of mids. Stacks of mids. Uh, so that would be, um, there's like an ant on there. Uh, gatekeepers, fuses, verdicts, truths, all the mids that I throw. Um, and then that, that would be a stack of drivers, kind of backups and stuff that I use. Uh, you can tell there's a lot of whites and like bright colors in there. That's what I like. Um, a lot of triple X's, um, getaways, a lot of bio getaways for sure, especially at the bottom. Uh, Explorer, Defender, a lot of the stuff that I throw. Um, then over here is actually uh, Kayla, Kayla's discs. I was going through them as well, kind of organizing them for her. She's got a sweet, sweet hand eye felon right there. That thing's nice. Uh, harp. She's got one of my discs. That's a sheriff. And under it, this is an old lava trespass hand eye stamp. Uh, but yeah, that uh, that kind of is what. And then there's Zoe kicking it. What's up, Zoe? Hey. But yeah, that kind of kind of sums up. What's, uh, what I got, you know, um, yeah, and then got some random, random stuff from AM, PDGA Amateur World Doubles Championships, it's kind of cool, my USDGC disc from last year, that's kind of an important one I want to hold on to, um, so yeah, guys, that's, uh, a lot of the, the random stuff that I have, actually, all, all my stuff, um, I think I do have some more stuff at my, my mom's house, um, like in her garage, just random, like older, older stuff. But, uh, yeah, so I don't have, to, I don't have too many like collectors items or gems or anything like that. Uh, I know some people collect and have discs that are worth hundreds of dollars. Uh, I, I'm more into throwing, throwing my discs and, uh, yeah, if a disc looks cool, I might keep, might keep it and not throw it. But for the most part, I throw all my stuff, but, uh, yeah, guys. Thanks for thanks for watching and uh hope to hope to see you guys soon.